This is a quick demo of some of the features of GHC IDE, the Haskell IDE. Uh, first thing to start with, if we hover over any, I, I've opened the matching engine in Agent, uh, and if we hover over any of the types or definitions, we can see where they're defined and what their types are. If we then control click uh, and click on them, we can go to that definition. Uh, similarly, for the imports, uh, we can also see, click on them to go to their origination. Uh, as we change the code, if we introduce any bugs, uh, syntactic or otherwise, uh, so I've introduced syntax error and it uh, correctly reports uh, the error very quickly. Uh, if I then change uh, some code in a way that is uh, incorrect, um, but not syntactically incorrect, I'll get a type error. Um, if, I, if I look at a definition, if I remove the definition, then a, uh, GHCID puts back the definition that GHC inferred. In this case, it's a slightly more general one than the one I'd written, but I can click on it to have it inserted. Uh, when writing imports, I can I get completions, so I can quickly find the int map type. Ah, but alas, importing int map gives me ambiguous occurrences below, so I can qual qualify it. And now uh, GHCID spots that it's unused. Uh, final thing I want to demo, if I don't have an extension or start using a new extension, then I immediately get an error. And I also have a completion to add the view patterns extension. So while working in my code, I can start using the view pattern extension turn it on at the top of the file without visiting the top of the file and everything works once more. Thanks very much.